Germany is a place full of culture, history, and beautiful architecture. Welcome to the Orange Travel. In today's video, we are going to show you the top 10 places to visit in Germany. If you are looking for more travel tips, make sure to hit subscribe button and ring that notification bell. Let's get started. So, one of the best places to visit in Germany has to be Hamburg. Hamburg, Germany's second largest city and the country's most populous metropolis, sits on the banks of the River Elbe. With a population of 2.8 million people, it is Germany's fifth largest city. The port city has been an important trading hub since its founding in 811 AD by Charlemagne, and features many historic buildings as well as modern architecture and design. The old harbor area, called Spikerstad, is home to several museums, including a maritime museum that houses replicas of famous ships and boats from around the world. Hamburg also has many parks perfect for picnics or just relaxing in nature, including Plant and Unbloemen Park, where you can enjoy live music outdoors over multiple seasons each year. The next place is Rhine River. The Rhine River is one of the most famous rivers in Europe, and it flows through six countries. The river starts in the Swiss Alps and flows into Germany at Lake Constance, then continues through Germany until it reaches its mouth at Rotterdam in Holland. The Rhine River is famous for its castles. There are over 500 castles along the Rhine River more than any other river in the world. Many of these castles were built during medieval times by knights, who traveled along this route to fight battles and protect their people from invaders. The next place is Fussen. Fussen is a town in Bavaria, Germany. It's popular with tourists. Because its location in the foothills of the Alps makes it ideal for hiking and other outdoor activities. It's also close to Neuschweinstein Castle, which was built by King Ludwig Kuhn, who famously died under mysterious circumstances at age of 40. If you're looking for something more relaxing than hiking, there are plenty of art museums and beautiful churches around Fussen worth checking out as well. The next place is Munich. Munich is the capital and largest city of the second most populous German federal state of Bavaria. It is located on the river Isar, north of the Bavarian Alps. Munich is one of the most important economic centers in Germany and a cultural, political, and financial hub in southern Europe. Munich is home to many universities, museums, galleries, and theaters, all within a few blocks of each other, featuring performances from international orchestras at the Herkulesaal, Hercules Hall. The next place is Frankfurt. Frankfurt is a city that doesn't just have a skyline, it has a skyline with a view. The main river runs through the center of the city and has been home to many tall buildings since the 14th century. While Frankfurt does not offer much in terms of historical attractions, it does have some modern monuments and museums worth checking out. Frankfurt is one of the world's biggest and busiest airports, which makes Frankfurt an ideal place for travelers to visit before their flights take off or land. If you're looking for something unique to do in Frankfurt that doesn't involve air travel, consider taking a leisurely walk along its riverfront path or visiting one of its many museums and art galleries such as Museum Sufer or Stadel Museum. The next place is Dusseldorf. Dusseldorf is the fourth largest city in Germany and a major financial center. The town of Dusseldorf is situated along the banks of the Rhine River, which flows through this part of Germany. The city has an extensive and well-maintained bus and tram network, as well as its own metro system, making it easy for tourists to move around. The Rain Terrace Promenade runs along the river bank for approximately 2 kilometers. It provides some stunning views over Dusseldorf's old town, with its red sandstone buildings dating back centuries. Next place is Cologne. Cologne is the largest city in the German federal state of North Rhine-Westphalia and the fourth largest city in Germany. It is located within the rhine ruhr metropolitan region, one of the major European metropolitan areas and with more than 10 million inhabitants, the largest in Germany. Cologne is famous for its university, the University of Cologne, the largest in Germany, as well as its cathedral, the Cologne Cathedral, the seat of the Archbishop of Cologne. The city's administration is headed by the mayor and the two deputy mayors. The city's economy is based on a diversified mix of high-tech industries, research institutes, media companies, and traditional craft and production industries. Cologne is an important cultural center for the Rhineland and has a vibrant art scene in a variety of genres. The city is home to more than 30 museums and hundreds of galleries. 
Exhibitions range from local ancient Roman archaeological sites to contemporary graphics and sculpture. The Cologne Zoo is one of the most visited zoos in Germany. Photography is not allowed in some museums. Some museums are closed on Mondays. Next place is Rothenburg. The town of Rothenburg is located in Middle Franconia and is surrounded by forests, vineyards, and fields. It is also known as the town of a thousand half-timbered houses. The town has become very popular with tourists from all over the world who come to see its medieval architecture, including the famous UNESCO World Heritage Site, Berghoenstaufen, which towers above it. The most exciting thing about this place is that even if you're not into history or old buildings, you can still find plenty to do here. There are many restaurants with traditional German fare such as sausages, schnitzels, pretzels, and other local specialties. You should also be sure not to miss out on trying some ice cream while visiting Rothenburg. Next place is Nuremberg. Nuremberg is the second largest city in Bavaria, and it's known for its medieval old town with its Gothic churches and buildings. It is also a city of art and history, home to many museums like the German Hunting Museum, which is one of Europe's largest collections on hunting. Nuremberg is also known for its rich culture of music and festivals, such as the Christmas market which takes place every year, from December 1st until December 23rd. Next place is Berlin. Berlin is one of the most culturally diverse cities in Germany, with influences from all over the world. The city has a rich history and is home to some of Germany's most famous landmarks, including the Brandenburg Gate and the Berlin Wall. There are also plenty of attractions and activities available for visitors who want to enjoy their time in Berlin. Here are 10 top places to visit when you're in Berlin. Check out historic sites like the Berlin Wall, the Reichstag Building, and Brandenburg Gate. Head to one of Berlin's many parks for a relaxing day outdoors. There are also plenty of museums and galleries to visit in the city, including the Museum Island and Kaiser Wilhelm Memorial Church. Sample German cuisine at local restaurants or try out some traditional German drinks at nighttime bars. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments, please let us know in the comment section below. If you want to see more videos like this, be sure to hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching.